Alright guys, welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. Battle 92. It's quite admirable for you to come this far, but I'm afraid your journey will end in disappointment in a raging sandstorm. So yes, we're going to be dealing with a sandstorm team. Which, uh... I think was a thing in professional Pokemon playing something. But, ugh. This is going to be bad. Well, they pull... Okay, so... Okay, yep. Tyranitar auto-whips up a sand stream. Let's go... Oh, I don't know. You. You're going to use Protect. Oh. Smart. Our Earthquake can't take him out. Mm. It does half health to Vaporeon. Of course. Yep, and then he goes for Earthquake. But does like nothing to Gretchen. Still doesn't take Vaporeon out. That's awesome. That's gonna hate that. Oh, that. The Sandstorm took Vaporeon out. That's disappointing. Okay, let's go with, uh... Procrasty or Tiamat, I guess. This is gonna be actually a rough battle. Um, earthquake and flamethrower. Okay, so Tyranitar uses protect this time. Yeah, Tyranitar protected itself. There goes Tiamat. Of course, I get a critical on my own guy. Because why, why not? There goes Zagron. So we've taken out one of his. Ooh, Gretchen got a good amount of experience for that. All right, and here comes a Sand Slash, so yay. All right, Brick Break, Body Slam. There, there goes Tyranitar. A little extra damage. Come on, a little extra experience is all I need. Oh, that sand availability. I don't know what Crush Claw does. Can that like lower my defense? I think it might, yeah. I was hoping that it would have paralyzed him too. Okay, so let's uh, slash the Gligar and body slam the Sand Slash. Gligar's faster. There goes Boogie. Alright, we'll go with Procrasty now. I don't know, it's three on three. So it could could go either way, really. Oh, that earthquake's gonna hurt. Yeah, there goes Gretchen. Oof. Okay. I'll probably need to revive somebody. All right, so Switch is not going to take any damage from Sandstorm, essentially. Ooh, Reflex is not a bad idea. Yeah, we're going to do that. 
That's actually going to help us quite a bit. Okay, so 50 damage on Switch. 50 damage on Procrasty. That actually helped quite a bit. That's going to be it for Procrasty, but with the Reflect up... Oh, I was hoping that was going to be enough. Okay. Um... Let's go. <laughs> I, I don't feel like I need to use the Sacred Ash on this battle. We're going to do that. Oh, I'm glad that missed. Well, there goes the Reflect. Okay, maybe I need to use the Sacred Ash on this battle. That's going to be a bit of a shame. Alright. I can't use it. Why can I not use it? Well, that's a problem. Ice Beam. He hits with guillotine. <laughs> we fail. Oof. That is not great. <laughs> that is a rough battle. That is rough. Ooh, okay. I feel like we could try that again, but that means I have to actually go through all of the rain battle once more. Which is kind of annoying. Um, so why can't I use the Sacred Ash? Like, why can't I use that in a battle? Hmm. Alrighty, well, um, wait, who are you? Oh. Yeah, hold on. Let's, let's look at this. Uh. I don't know. Um, Vaporeon, sure. Okay, so this just sh gives all of the moves that it could have possibly learned. Which I don't think is going to actually help us here with any of these guys. I'm just taking a look. Lick isn't bad. A light screen wouldn't be horrible either, but ugh. Okay, well, hmm. Let's go let's go do a um let's go do a random trainer battle, I think. Get us a little extra levels. Alright, let's battle Kayam, I think. Yeah, Tiamat need Tiamat needs some levels. Alright, Gardevoir and Granville. Kale, that's it, not Kayam. Kayam's from Rackengard. Ooh, Gretchen's close to a level up. Okay, that's fine. Trace Flash Fire, so I'm not going to use that. Brick Break there, and Faint Attack there. That almost took him out. I'm surprised. It didn't actually, like, fully take him out. 
All right, Thunder Punch. And his own Brick Break. Oof. Power. All right, this should take out those two. All right, well, when Granbull falls, that'll be uh, a level up for Gretchen. There we go. Not bad speed, actually. Oh, and a Houndoom. Break there. Flamethrower there. Maybe we'll get a level up by beating up this Houndoom for Tiamat. It knows Sludge Bomb. Ooh. That's an interesting move. Nope, TM at fa <laughs> faints, so. Now let's go with Procrasty. Brick Break and Thunderbolt. I don't know if that would have actually gotten us a level up. Alright, let's battle somebody else. Uh, and let's switch around our guys too. Oh, I actually have to heal here, that's right. All right, hotel. Okay, let's battle, I don't know, this guy. These are some uh, evolved Pokemon. Okay. Brick Break, you, Flamethrower, you as well. Ooh, almost. Oh, yeah, this guy has the crappy A palm. All right, uh, brick break and flamethrower. There we go. Tiamat needed that. For one defense. <laughs> that did 13 damage. That's some sort of power this trainer has. Okay, so with with us having a little bit of extra training in, uh, it's not really gonna like add into anything really significant. 
Uh, it will make War Coliseum a little bit easier if we were to try that again. But I think... Um, I think what we're going to do is we are going to... Um, be ending this LP for the time being. Uh, basically, another hiatus, because I have been doing those so much lately. Um, and so the idea, um, the idea is we're not going to do or Coliseum. Uh, I don't think it's worth all the time and effort that would need to be put into that. Um, for poke coupons and whatnot, we are going to go get the spot. Um, but we're going to be on a bit of a hiatus so that I can think about the mount battle because I still want to show that off. Um, and it's just going to take a little bit for that. That... is not a shiny one. It looked so different from the overworld view. Uh, we're just gonna we're gonna capture it just to be absolutely sure. Oh come on. I mean I could try slash but Ultra Ball. There we go. It had looked different in the overworld, which is one of the reasons why I'm capturing it, but it doesn't look like it's a shiny, so... There is no indication in this game as to whether or not a Pokemon is shiny or not, unless you send it in a battle. Okay, so what I'm thinking is we're going to be on hiatus. We're going to end up doing Mount Battle at some other time. Uh, it might be that I end up bringing in, like, some other Pokemon or something. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but when we come back, uh, we're going to have a new LP, I think. So, thanks for watching, and I will see you then.